Hello everyone, how's everyone doing? I hope everyone's doing great. Um, today, we're in Namba, Osaka. Since the uh, lockdown is finished last week, I wanted to come out and check out um, and just, just do normal things. Um, I usually come down here on the weekends and just do window shopping and I usually meet my usually come here with my girlfriend and we just look around and stuff like that so um, I haven't been able to do that in a long time and my girlfriend right now is getting her hair cut and I'm gonna meet her in a couple hours and I thought I would just come down here and just show you guys what it looks like after life after the lockdown and it looks like it's pretty normal it's not as busy like it was pre lockdown but I think because it was raining a little bit people have dispersed um, and usually like this area here there's a lot of people but right now there's not that many people like taking pictures and stuff so we're gonna walk around here and I'm gonna try to find something interesting I've pretty much done everything around this area possible um, unless I've missed anything and worst comes to worst I will just uh, play some claw machine games because um, I'm addicted now since uh, I've made that claw machine game video I was just looking at this this uh, building right here and I've never been inside so I'm kind of considering going inside but I don't know what's inside this seems like a just like two restaurants upstairs maybe I'm not gonna go just keep walking so it looks like there's a uh, there's usually always someone taking pictures in front of the glycoman there's some women here modeling in front of the uh, this glycoman taking pictures asking people to take pictures for them and then there's some people over here hanging out on the river and uh, uh, the day's not that great it's about five o'clock ish it's about almost six o'clock and um, the weather's not so great today so it's not the best day to come out but I think this is probably the first Saturday yeah this is the first Saturday since the lockdown has um, finished so yeah so this place is really popular for people taking the picture just like the glide command but it's not lit up yet so I'm guessing in a couple hours it's going to be lit up All right, so I was just hanging out here for a little bit just um, because it's just been hot recently and right now it's the weather is pretty good. So just been kind of just hanging out here for like five minutes, took a uh, time lapse for the other video and just kind of enjoying the scenery. <laughs> this feels good just being out for once, you know, just feel like everything's open, but you know, um, I'm, I'm, I'm assuming cases are going to go back up after this lockdown uh, finish i mean after this uh this week finishes i'm sure cases will go up there's a taco bell right there yeah i don't know what to do i don't really have any plans i just came down here maybe we'll just walk around some more find the toilet i need to use the bathroom some here. these ice cream cookies this looks really really good look at this I don't even know what this is so I think you just put in a thousand yen and you might win something in the ball but most likely it's gonna be nothing I think they're selling something here on sale All right, we're in the claw machine games. They don't have really good ones here, maybe. It smells like uh, pee. It smells like urine. This looks so easy right here. I think that's what they try to do, make it look easy. They make it look so easy. Got some uh, Kirby's here. I might do one. I might do some Kirby. I wanna get the Snorex. Do I get it? Oh my gosh, no. But this Kirby. I got you. Oh, that was so close. Maybe this one. Get it, get it, get it. Oh no. I'm gonna try this Kirby. Oh. Alright, this is the last one. I spent so much money already. Alright, 
last one. Maybe I gotta do it closer. Oh, it's like a bomb. Get it, get it. Oh! oh so nice. She even gave me a little bag. Actually, I've never, I've never won one of these. Alright, so it's really nice because uh, I've never won anything. So, but the lady after this one dropped the first time, she um, she like moved it so I can make it easier. She moved it around so I can win it easier. So yeah. that lady was really nice. On the second floor. But I've never won anything, so this is my first time. I spent like five or six dollars. Now I gotta carry this everywhere. Alright, now what to do, what to do. Even the karaoke places are open. Yeah, so like these you gotta like put in um you can even put like a hundred bucks in here. And then you get to, uh, you might be able to win one of these. Like a police girl outfit. I think I know that, um, you know the person on the cover. Just kidding. <laughs> uh, you can win some meat. Some raw beef. Probably not in the, in the machine. You can uh, win a Hello Kitty. And some other stuff in here. I don't know the uh, likelihood of winning something. Maybe we win a Dior bag. I don't know what's inside though. More takoyaki. This place looks really good actually. Yeah, it, it doesn't have that um, feel like it like before the lockdown, but um, it's better than the lockdown. So I don't. There, there, uh, there are more people here, but not, not as much as pre-pandemic, and it's a Saturday. I don't know what this store is. Ah, uh, it must be like a cosmetic store. Forza. This is new too. This lady dancing. More takoyaki. I've never even noticed this before. Shoot and play guns and uh, can win a uh, snacks. I've never seen this one before. Yeah, must be new. I've eaten here a long time ago with my girlfriend. It's just this place has been here for a long time. It just reminds me of one of those old restaurants back home. But they have everything here. All this like ice cream and sweets and bread, spaghetti. It's very like Americanized, I would think. It's like, it's like an American version of like an old diner. Look at the look at the antique lights up here. Oh, you know what? It even says American right here. American. I think that's what they uh, show. This guy's buff as hell. Yeah, like this uh, tax-free store is closed. Just, I mean, before it would be like 50% closed. It seems like now it's like 25% closed. Just gonna keep walking. Got another uh, claw machine game place. It's very enticing. I wanna just go and play some more. I go look for, maybe we'll look real quick. There's nobody inside. Upstairs. You wanna get one try? Oh, we win! Come on! Oh, you only get one try, but I keep going. Oh, that was close. Oh man. Oh come on! Is that glued? Come on! Come on! Come on! Oh! Oh! Oh no! This is the last one. You know, 
once you win something, you feel like you can do anything. Let's see. Oh my gosh, that's close. Look at how close this is. Is it a trick? Oh man. They, they even teach you how to win it. Alright, I think I spent this total of 2,000 yen, which is like 20 bucks, and I won two. So basically, there is um, a screen on the bottom where it shows you how to play, and I was getting so frustrated that I was like shaking the. I was shaking the um, the machine and I think they heard me because I was getting angry and then the lady was so nice she taught me exactly how to do it and then I didn't know the thing rotates and then so you, what you're supposed to do is you're supposed to push it push that thing down and basically it gets stuck so you gotta pay um, you have to pay a certain amount of money because they purposely make it stuck so you have to push it all the way down and I ended up winning it I didn't have it on camera but I won it and um, it's like my first time ever winning and I won it twice so they make it they make it easy for you to win I think these smaller ones these smaller ones are easier and the fact and the thing is they they were right behind me waiting for me to get the um, to get the, the doll because they kind of knew that I was getting it so I want to go in upstairs there's an upstairs as well and I think there's like a game area all right, this is the upstairs. Looks like they have all like retro games here as well. Whoa, got some Street Fighter. I'm a little embarrassed because I was shaking the uh, machine like a madman. And then when I came back, they looked at me. Here's Mario Kart 2. It's a third floor. I don't know what, if there's anything up on the third floor. There's some more retro games. There's some uh, street performance here. Doing some magic. All right, this is where I was originally gonna go round one um, to play games, but I already ran to two of those game places. I feel like the smaller ones are easier because there's less people there and. Um, the thing is that the one that I just went to, I um, I got so frustrated because it got stuck in that little thing, and so I started shaking it really violently, and I think they heard me, and so I feel a little embarrassed because when I went back after I shot um, a little short clip, I guess, when I went back, they were like looking at me, like they were talking to each other and looking at me, so I felt a little embarrassed when I walked back in and I just left, so. Um, I'm looking for a toilet right now. I, um, I think my girlfriend's going to be done soon. So I was thinking about going to Denden Den Town, but I think I changed my, changed my mind. I'm looking for a toilet. Big Camera usually has decent toilets. They're not, they're not amazing, but they're not terrible. So I'm gonna go try in there and then I'm gonna look around inside. I think they changed up this liquor area. Let me just have a look. Looks like just mostly uh, sake on this side. 
think this is all tax free as well. There's always people in here, like tax free places, checking the prices, making sure it's a good deal and not. That's a soju. This is really bright. Bunch of liquor here. They got some Shivas, some Regal. All sorts of stuff here. I'm not, I don't really know a lot of these labels or brands. There's no a few of them. Yeah, I think, you know what? They just extended this area. I think this last time it was just this area. Got some champagne here. They got a lot of variety of here, variety of alcohol. I wonder if they have um, tequila. Wow, they do have tequila. They got the Patron. 45 bucks for the big bottle. I do like Patron. Got some Grey Goose here. Grey Goose for 35 bucks. I forgot, I, I don't drink alcohol anymore, but I, I forgot what it costs back home. I feel like it's less than $35 for that bottle of Grey Goose. And the Belvedere is for 40 bucks. I got a really cool selection of um, snacks here. They got some Hersey cookies and cream pretzel. They got the Tim Tan. Yeah, they got a lot of good um, beer snack food. Yeah, if you're having a party, this is where you where you come get some alcohol, get some uh, finger snacks, got some pickles. Wow, look at this selection of beer. Yeah, a lot of good stuff here. Duval, Stella, Whole Garden. I've never seen this. Um, oh, it's a Whole Garden Rosé. Wow. That looks pretty good actually. They even got the Negra model, Modelo. Got a pretty good selection here. They even have Coronas. Got some Xingtao. Uh, they got the Xingha. They got the Chinese and Thai. And maybe Vietnamese now. They even sell like mini refrigerators. All right, I uh, use the toilet and I'm at the uh, Apple section of this place. These are the new iMacs, which are pretty nice. I'm gonna wait for, I wanna wait until I get a job and then I'm gonna pick up another, um, I'm gonna pick up a laptop, maybe a MacBook Pro. I'm, I'm thinking maybe the 14 inch when it comes out, either that or the 13 inch with um, a lot of memory and all of that stuff. All right, this is the uh, big camera outlet. I always stop by here because they always have like cheap TVs on display. I just want to see the prices. These are usually like the display models. So they're a lot cheaper. Nobody in here. There's a 55 inches for about 650 bucks. That's a pretty good deal. Yeah, these are gonna be like store models, you know, who knows how long they've been out on display, but they always have, not always, but you, on certain season, you'll, you'll catch a really good deal. Look at this high sense, 65 inches for 900 bucks. That's a pretty good deal. 55 inch for about 900 bucks. Nothing too crazy. This sharp 55 inch for 700, 700 bucks. I mean, they even have smaller TVs. 300 bucks for this 40 inch. 600 bucks for that 43 inch. This one, oh, these are like no name brands though. Here's some uh, washing machines. 200 bucks, 200 bucks. This one does, this one feels cheap, 800 bucks, 700 bucks. These small little ovens, you can't even put 
What are you gonna put in there? One cupcake? It's like 20 bucks for this oven. All right, while we're here, why don't we just look at the toy section real quick? Actually, I've never seen the toy collection at this big camera. I thought I did. I made a full tour of this place a long time ago, but I think they recently changed this place up. I think because the other electronic stores all have like this type of um, like setup where they have like like if you go if you watch my Edion videos, their their toy setup is crazy because it's a new place. And Joshin, this this place looks just like a Joshin to me. Three hundred bucks. Guess we're just gonna go look around here real quick. I think I'm gonna meet up my girlfriend soon, so we'll just do this real fast. Yeah, these, are, these would be really good for like presents. Got some Doraemon. Look at all this uh, Gundam. Whoa, got some cool car stuff here. Oh my gosh, I, I never I never noticed how big this place was. Maybe I just maybe I either I missed it or they changed it up, I think. I don't remember this place being so crazy. All oh, these Tomoka cars. Got some Legos. Got this. Oh, 400 bucks. Look at this, all this stuff here. Whoa, I want to get this GTR. How much is it? It's it's only 25 bucks for some of these cars. The GTR is only 25 bucks. The Ferrari is about 25 bucks. It's actually not that bad. I would do it. It'd be a good present to give somebody. But I, oh, that one looks cool. But you know, I don't know if, if someone to come to visit, like, I don't know if they have this back home. They got this uh, Y-Wing. How much, how much is this? 70, 80 bucks for the um, X-Fighter. I would do that. Or the Millennium Falcon. R2-D2, Stormtrooper. A lot of cool stuff here. See, like, instead of winning one, you can just buy one for 800 yen. A lot of cool stuff here. Look at that, like, would you... I mean, I guess that's the fun of playing it, right? You can, like, win it. But look at this monster from uh, Monsters, Inc. I forgot his name. I wonder how much it is. Probably, like, 50 bucks, maybe 100 bucks. Well, this one is... 150 so this is probably like two three hundred dollars then and look at this uh gotcha area oh my goodness i've never seen such a gotcha area like this it was crazy what the heck look at this skyline got some jigsaw up there Wow, this is crazy. One of the subscribers were asking about these jigsaw puzzles. Come to the electronic stores, they have them. I mean, it seems like every jigsaw place they have, it's, they're always selling the same stuff. It's like Mount Fuji, 20 bucks. Um, just like nature stuff, some anime. You can get Mount Fuji for 20 bucks. And I think that's the frame for 25 bucks. So about 50 bucks, you can get a frame that big. 
That one's pretty cool. There's the uh, Golden Pavilion. So you can come to Japan, go to one of these places, and then get a puzzle and bring it back home. This one's the this one's cool. I would do that one if I like Pokemon. Dragon Ball Z, that's cool. Can't really see from the glare. Wow, this place has a lot of uh, jigsaw puzzles. I believe it was Jerus that was asking. If you want to get a jigsaw puzzle, come to Big Camera in Osaka. How, how many? There's three rows of it. Some Doraemon. This is out of control. I bet nobody's here. I don't think it's going to do well. Especially with Edion. I think that's why. I think because of Edion. Well, you know what? I feel like I've been here before, but I've, I, don't, I don't remember it being like this crazy. The piano. Look at this. I miss this. Look at this cool airplane. Man, I would buy this if I was a little kid. Well, somebody would have to buy it for me. How much is this airplane? It's 120 bucks. That is so cool. And a car can go inside. I got another airplane, 70 bucks for that, for that whole set. Oh man. That bolt too. Alright guys, um, I think I'm going to end the video here. I'm going to continue making another video. I'm not sure um, how long the next video is going to be because I'm going to go meet up my girlfriend right now. Um, but I hope you enjoyed like this vlog style. Um, video um, it's a little different than I what I usually do I guess maybe it's the same but um, I hope you enjoyed coming along with me and winning these prizes and um, please look out for future videos and thank you for watching goodbye see ya